Hello everyone, let's start with exercise 1.6. So, I would be starting with question number 1. So, in this it says 64 raised to power half. So, now we know that 64 can be writ written as 8 square. So, we have half on it. We know that whenever we have power on power, so we need to multiply them. So, it will be 2 into 1 over 2 and 2 and 2 gets cancelled out. So, we are left with 8. So, the answer for first is 8. Second is 32 raised to power 1 over 5. Now, we know that 32 can be written as 2 raised to power 5 and it can be written as 1 over 5. So, 5 and 5 gets cancelled out. We are left with 2. Now, the third part we have is 125 raised to power 1 by 3. Now, we know that 125 is 5 cube equal to 5 cube. So, 1 over 3, 3 and 3 gets cancelled out. We are left with 5. Now, the next one. Next is 9 raised to power 3 by 2. So, 9 can be written as 3 square over 3 over 2. 2 and 2 gets cancelled out. We are left with 3 raised to power 3, which is equivalent to 27. Now, the second one, it is 32 raised to the power 2 by 5. So, 32 as we have done in the first version, it was 2, 2 raised to the power 5. So, 2 over 5. 5 and 5 gets cancelled. We are left with 2 square. So, 2 square equals 4. Now, the third one we have is 16 raised to the power 3 by 4. So, 16 can be written as 4 square or it can be written as 2 raised to the power 4. Why I am writing 2 raised to power 4 is because uh, we have 3 over 4 as the other power. So, 4 and 4 gets cancelled out. We are left with 2 raised to power 3 and 2 raised to power 3 can be written as 8. Now, the fourth one we have is 125 raised to power minus 1 over 3. Now, we can write 125 as 5 raised to power 3 and we have minus 1 over 3. 3 and 3 gets cancelled out. We are left with 5 raised to power minus 1. Or we can write it as 1 over 5. So, this is question number 2. Now, moving on to question number 3. Now, here we need to apply laws of exponents. So, in the first one, we have sign of or dot or multiplication sign and base is same. So, as we have done all the law of components, law of exponents, sorry. So, in this case, what we need to use is a raised to power m dot a raised to power n and it can be written as a m plus n. So, we need to add the exponents of these. So, 2 over 3 plus 1 over 5. So, it will be 2 and taking LCM of the exponent, we will get 15. So, we need to make 15 the first term. So, it will be 10. Need to multiply the second term with 3. So, it will be plus 3. So, the final answer to this is 13 over 15. Now, the second one is 1 raised to power 3 cube over 7. Now, whenever there is question such, so question like this, you need to do is, we need to bring this 7 to 1 as well as to the lower bottom term. That will be 3 into 7. You need to multiply the exponents. So, it will be 3 into 7 that is 21. So, it can be written as 1 over 3 raised to power 21. Now, the third part. Third part is in division. So, the division formula is that you need to Subtract the exponents. So, it is 11 raised to the power half. Eleven raised to the power half and 11 raised to the power 1 by 4. Now, the base is same. What you need to do is, we need to use this formula that is AM divided by AN. So, it can be written as AM minus N. We need to subtract M and N. So, half minus 1 over 4. So, half minus 4 can be written as taking LC 4. Need to, need to make first term as 4. 
so it will be 2 here so 2 minus 1 so it will be 11 1 over 4 the answer is 11 1 over 4 now the fourth part the fourth part is 7 raised to power half dot 8 raised to power half so now what you need to do is you need to take uh, as in this case you can see the exponents are same and the base is different so in this case you can see what we need to do is use this formula and it is that you need to take the base and multiply them so 7 into 8 is 56 and the exponent is common so it can be written as half so that's your answer for exercise 1.3 sorry 1.6 i hope you liked it Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thank you for watching this.